Welcome to our reef tank. Hey there people who've been subscribing to my updates. Uh, it's been a long time since we've done an update and in that time a lot of changes have happened. The tank's in a new home. I moved a couple of months ago. We got new livestock. We've got a bunch of new equipment and uh, the tank is overall very similar but a few key things are different. Um, you can see swimming around there a yellow eye coal tang. We've got two Ocellaris clownfish over on the right. A orange and white standard Ocellaris and then a black and white Darwin clown. We've got two green chromas there and there's a uh, royal grandma hiding in the rock work. I'll include a close-up of that later. Um, on the lower right we've got a red bubble tip anemone and then over on the left we have some green star polyps and that's all we've got so far for like coral and inverts. Um, you know, we're gonna plan to add some more corals mostly LPS, maybe a bird's nest, maybe some Recordia, but that's kind of the general plan. Keep things really simple and easy to take care of. Uh, equipment wise, we've got a Tunzi 6040 over on the left and a Tunzi 6025 over on the right. I really like the 6040 and I'm planning to get a second one so I can use them together. Uh, lighting wise, we're using a 48 inch Vertex Illumilux merino bianco fixture it's got blue and white leds and it runs at about 72 watts it's been pretty good for um, everything in the tank although i don't really have any light hungry corals to judge by we just added a 48 inch aquatic life 460 nanometer actinic led light strip and that's just to create a little bit more of a blue look and to add some moonlighting effects uh, we got on the back tank of the tank let's check take a look at the back You can see like this nice row of equipment. We've got a remora skimmer with the overflow for the intake. We've got the CPR aquafuge from the first generation. We have a little bit of a micro bobble problem going on with that right now, but I'm gonna work on it. I don't have anything fancy going on in the fuge other than some Kemi Pure Elite and a little bit of live rock. We're gonna plan to grow some Chato or Kel Kelerperna, I don't know how to pronounce that. I've got the Intelli feeder, which is easily the best automatic fish feeder I've seen. And then all the way down there we have a JBJ cooling fan. The heater is actually in here. I put it inside the remora. You can see it right here. There's a heater cable and just it runs out the output. That's worked out really well and it's keeping the heater out of the tank, so I like that. Um, underneath we have a seven gallon reservoir. I'm not going to bother showing it because it's just a bucket of water, but that's being used to top off via the Tunzi Nano Osmolator. We've also got an eShops doser, and that doser is going into um, the Hang On Back Refugium. Anyways, that's our tank. Uh, thanks for checking it out. We appreciate it. And uh, feel free to leave any comments in the comments section or PM me any questions you might have. Have a good end of the summer.